Hi guys, welcome to my channel, Dirty and Green. Um, this is my very first post, hopefully one of many. I've got this lovely little newborn lamb here. She's a twin, but she's probably about half the size of a regular newborn lamb. We have Suffolk's here, and she's just a tiny girl. Um, so she was uh, laying in the ground, cold and wet and unresponsive. But um, I popped her under the, under the heat lamp here in our whelping shed, and she's doing a lot better now. Um, still, She's awfully weak and she's awfully small. So just to be on the safe side, I ran to the vet and I got a dextrose injection that I'm going to go ahead and give her now. So this is a little uh, how-to on giving an, a dextrose injection to a newborn lamb. Now generally when you do this, um, if you've got a lamb that you think is hypothermic, uh, if it's quite unresponsive and you think it's been in the cold for a long time, then you want to give the dextrose injection before you put them under the heat lamp because giving them that uh, heat shock before you give them extra energy can actually bring them closer to death. I didn't have the dextrose on hand so I took a chance and I popped her under the lamp and it's, it's been about uh, 45 minutes and she's doing much better. So it's working. We've got a bleating lamb and uh, she's also got her suck reflex back so I think she's actually doing really well. But um, just to be on the safe side, we're going to give her this dextrose injection, and, uh, and then we'll see about a bottle later on if we need to. So, uh, this is a 25 mil dextrose, 20% uh, dextrose injection with a 21 gauge hypodermic needle, just to be on the safe side. And the way we do this is about an inch below the belly button, and about an inch to the right or left, pointing towards the tail head. Holy cow. I'm just going to stick that baby in. And away we go. You don't even feel that hardly, do you? Amazing. He wiggled. Okay, we're going to stick it in again. That's still a little sweetie. That's a good girl. Okay, easy peasy. Oh, look at how lively she is. She's not standing yet, but she's much better than she was 45 minutes ago. We'll give her a little spritz of some iodine on that navel. And it's always a good idea to do this on any newborn animal, but she's been laying in the mud, so it's extra important. We'll pop her back under the heat lamp, and we'll check on her in another hour.